economic activity are up for the months ahead. Finally, a Realtors Trade Group report shows existing home sales up sharply in December from November, even if they're still lower than a year before in a depressed overall market. Paul Brown, NPR News. Earnings for banking giant Morgan Stanley showed signs of improvement during the just-completed quarter. The New York-based bank says for the three months ending in December, it earned $600 million after paying preferred stock dividends, or roughly 41 cents a share. That was on revenues of $7.8 billion. Still, stocks lost ground on some other somewhat disappointing financial results. All the major indexes ending the day lower. The Dow Jones Industrial Average fell two points to close at 11,822. The Nasdaq lost 21 points. The S&P 500 dropped a point today. This is NPR. Support for NPR comes from American Express Open, offering online tools and solutions for small business owners. Learn more at open.com. Start booming. For Wyoming Public Radio News, I'm Molly Messick. The time is 5.04. A bill that would ban all gay marriages from being recognized in the state was given initial approval in the Wyoming House today. Supporters say they are trying to preserve the family and emphasize that marriage should only exist between a man and a woman. But Cheyenne Democrat Mary Throne said the bill simply targets the rights of a minority. Each one of us has constituents who fall into the class attacked, and I mean attacked, by this bill. That's all it's about. It's about picking on people who are different. But Douglas Republican Frank Peasley objected to Throne's view. This is not about cruelty. This is not about being mean. And it's disingenuous to say that, uh, well, they're made this way. And uh, I understand that. But uh, but I sure don't understand this thing about multiple marriages. Uh, it is all the same. Peasley says the measure is needed to have a clear definition of marriage in the state. The bill will be debated two more times. Two bills filed this week in the Wyoming legislature would require videotaped class periods.